We're here with Senator Kennedy, a Republican from Louisiana. Senator, impeachment. Uh -huh. Will uh, are Republicans still standing behind President Trump at this point? Well, y yes. We don't have any facts. Um, I'm not exactly what I'm, I'm not sure what Speaker Pelosi said yesterday. I think she said the investigation continues. Um, We've been in an investigation for, I don't know, a year and a half. There's six House committees working on it. They're investigating. They're not, you know, playing Candy Crush over there. Uh, I don't know what's changed, except that the Speaker now has officially endorsed him. I think she's always supported him. Otherwise, they wouldn't have happened. And on the issue of this, this phone call, we're going to get the transcript uh -huh. and the whistleblower complaint. Right. Should, should the whistleblower complaint be made public? I think they're planning on making it public. I don't know. Things are happening pretty quickly. Here's what I know. Uh, trying to look at this from the point of view of the American people. Um, President Trump said I did absolutely nothing wrong. Uh, some of my Democratic friends said, yes, you did. It was outrageous. And what you did is going to end Western civilization. Um, we're going to get the facts. The whistleblower complaint is going to be, uh, at some point, I presume, revealed. We're going to get a transcript. Um, I think most Americans, not the crank wings, not the crank wings on the left and the right, but most Americans are saying, okay, you know, we'd like to know what happened. What did Trump say to Zelensky? Why did he say it? What's this business about uh, Vice President Biden's son in, in Ukraine? And that's all going to be talked about probably for the next year and a half until the election. You're someone who's very plugged into Republican leadership in the mm -hmm. Senate. Uh, what has Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell been telling Republicans about uh, about how to proceed as the House navigates through an, imp imp an impeachment inquiry? Not much. And and though I, I, I respect Mitch and love him, he's a great leader, um, senators... Um, don't take instructions real well. They barely take suggestions. So everybody's kind of calling it like they see it. I, I'd prefer to, I didn't think we were going to get the transcript and was worried about the national security implications of doing it, but they've worked that out. I understand President Zelensky has said he's okay releasing the transcript, which is important because if you start releasing transcripts of conversations, foreign leaders won't talk to you. So we're going to know here today pretty soon. But how, I think it's the first step in a long saga. How, how much, oh, we've been in the saga. How, how long, uh, how, how able are lawmakers going to be from working on things like USMCA, working on other uh, bipartisan or nonpartisan items? Oh, it's going to be a distraction. A major I mean, distraction? But both, both the allegations about, the allegations about President Trump, which regardless of what the transcript says, I can assure you you're going to continue by the House. The, 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 that's going to upset a lot of folks. Uh, the allegations about uh, uh, the vice president and his son and his activity in Ukraine, that's going to stir a lot of people up. Um, you know, in a perfect world, we would put things into compartments and go about doing our business, but I've learned it doesn't work that way. And then 13 there. months until another election. Yeah, emotions run high, and, and uh, a lot of people just... I don't hate anybody. I disagree with folks sometimes, but I don't hate them. But there's a lot of hatred. Let me ask you about Joe Biden, Hunter Biden in huh? particular. Do you think that ought to be investigated? Do you think that there will be hearings in the Senate? Oh, I think, there's, I think it's going to be. Do you if, think he should be subpoenaed? If I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know enough to be able to say. I think it will be investigated. Uh, letting the cat out of the bag is a lot easier than putting the cat back in. I think it will be investigated, if not by Congress. Pres uh, Vice President Biden's running against uh, running for president. He's got a lot of opponents with a lot of good staff and op research, and I think they're going to bring it up.